morning news on CNN News 18. I am Anjali Pandey and across the next hour, we'll take you through the top stories from across the country and the world. Starting off the bulletin with some breaking news that's coming in. Now, more legal trouble for Congress leader Rahul Gandhi as another defamation case has been filed against him by Satyaki Savarkar, who is the grandson of V.D. Savarkar. Now, Satyaki Savarkar has approached the Pune court for a defamation case against Rahul Gandhi. So, fresh trouble for Congress leader Rahul Gandhi after he was convicted in the 2019 defamation case for his remarks against that you have filed a complaint for criminal defamation against Rahul Gandhi for his remarks against uh, Ved Savarkar. Can you please give us some details about this? Sure. So uh, we all know that Rahul Gandhi had visited uh, England last mm -hmm. month mm -hmm. and during one of uh, the bad things uh, he had said that uh, Mr. Uh, uh, sorry, Savarkar ji has written one book and mm -hmm. in that book he mm -hmm. has written that uh, he, along with five, six of his friends, mm. were beating up one Muslim person, mm. and the scene was enjoyable to Savarkarji. Mm. Uh, so, this entire uh, statement mm. is false, mm. it's baseless allegation, and uh, Rahul Gandhi has continued doing that from past several years, mm. and this particular this statement has. Uh, really hurt us. Many mm. of his followers are uh, not accepting this mm. because the entire incident is imaginary. Mm. Savarkarji has not written any of such incident mm. in his literature and I am sure about this. So if, uh, this is if, just to defame Savarkarji. Mm. Uh, he is taking his name time and again and uh, uh, you know, he is doing baseless allegations about it. CNN News 18's Vinaya Deshpande is joining about the allegation we have the case that has been filed. Well, it has been registered early. In fact, the complaint clearly states that these kind of statements that have been made by Rahul Gandhi in his uh, speech at uh, UK just last month have triggered uh, outrage among people who follow him. In fact, he goes ahead to say that uh, there is hurt as well. He goes ahead to give a long list of incidents where Rahul Gandhi uh, has allegedly been defaming Savarkar, saying that he is a habitual offender and that is why action should be taken against him. Now, this particular complaint, uh, the complaint has been given under Section 499 and Section 500 of the IPC for criminal defamation, seeking action against Rahul Gandhi, Satyaki Savarkar, who is the grandson of uh, Veer Vinayak Damodar Savarkar has stated that by making statements like these and he spoke elaborately to CNN News 18 last night saying what were the kind of statements that were uh, forget by Savarkar by anybody in any of the written literature that is being followed about Savarkar. Uh, so Satyaki Savarkar says that time and again Rahul Gandhi has become now remember this is not the first time that the Savarkar family has come out against Rahul Gandhi. In fact, we had seen uh, last time Ranjit Savarkar, who is the grand nephew of uh, the uh, Vyad Dhanayi Ramada Savarkar, had also registered a defamation case against Rahul Gandhi. Now, this is a fresh case that has been given uh, to the Pune court in Shivajinagar by Satyaki Savarkar. He says that he has received an acknowledgement of the complaint and thereafter, uh, the docket number will be received by the end of this week. Only then it will be understood on whether cognizance has been taken and any further action will be taken with respect to that. But clearly, troubles seem to be mounting for Rahul Gandhi. After action in one defamation case, now there is a, a hanging word of another defamation case against him, this time by the Savarkar family at uh, a Pune court, where uh, the Pune court will uh, take a call on this by the end of this week. Back to you. Right, Vinaya. Also, has anybody from the Congress reacted to this complaint filed by Satyaki Savarkar? It's a fresh complaint. As of now, we haven't seen any kind of a reaction coming from Congress. So the Congress has stated time and again, even with respect to the previous defamation cases that we have seen, that this is a specific stance with respect to Savarkar, that, uh, you know, the Congress party, the specific stance of Rahul Gandhi is also that Savarkar was a cowardice. Uh, you know, he shouldn't. 
we have to take a fresh reaction with respect to the case that is uh, the complaint that has been given uh, by Satyaki Savarkar as of now. But Congress has continued to maintain that it will remain firm on its terms that it finds uh, the position taken by Savarkar as a position of cowardice. Uh, that is something that uh, even the complaint that has been given to the Pune court by Satyaki Savarkar says that. Uh, Rahul Gandhi has continuously called several acts of Savarkar's as cowardice and uh, has not understood the kind of seriousness of uh, the punishment that was given to him and the hardship that he had faced. So in the several pages that have been submitted as a complaint uh, to the Pune court at Shivaji Nagar, uh, it goes on to narrate the kind of hardship that Savarkar has had to face uh, over the years during his Sajai Kalapani. Uh, also giving out details of what kind of brave decisions and the that have come out in the case. Uh, so this kind of uh, allegation uh, ha has been given a uh, page after page in that uh, specific uh, complaint that we see has been given to the Pune court. Back to you. Vinaya, also, as Rahul Gandhi is already fighting against the conviction uh, in the 2000 defamation case where he made a remark against uh, Modi, so, uh, can this mean that he should be now gearing up to fight another legal battle as he's already fighting against the conviction and he has already been disqualified as a, as a Lok Sabha MP? So, should he now be gearing up to fight this legal battle as well? Well, Anjali, possibility can definitely not be denied. We are seeing the kind of action that he has had to face due to one defamation case that was filed against him. Uh, the Surat Court pronounced uh, the judgment and thereafter, clearly uh, he the legal battle that follows Rahul Gandhi thereafter as well. Uh, but clearly, as of now, what we can say is that troubles continue to mount for Rahul Gandhi. Uh, this is not the first time that the Savatka family has uh, taken up uh, the statement that uh, Rahul Gandhi has issued against Savarkar. In fact, this is the second such complaint that the Savarkar family has made. But this is a fresh trouble for Rahul Gandhi. After the court decides what call it will take on the criminal defamation complaint that has been submitted to the Shivajanagar court, it will have to be seen on whether it will be another long protracted legal battle, this time in Pune for Rahul Gandhi. Back to you. All right, Vinaya, please stay with us.